Hi, welcome to Evermentor YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to see the wonderful opportunity to the any graduates, even the fresher or the experience, then no problem, guys. So, any graduates means any post graduates also can apply for this position. And uh, monthly, including the gross emoluments and everything, approximately, we are going to get the 70,000 rupees per month. So, which will be a wonderful opportunity, and it is a permanent government job, and you can apply from any state. And while coming to the selection process for this one will be happens at your nearest uh, city or the center itself that you can choose in while filling up of the online application form. So please share this video to your friends or colleagues who are looking for this type of opportunity. It will be very much helpful to them. And if your requirement is not there in this video, then please mention your requirement in the comment section. If I got the recruitment notification which is matching up with your subject, then definitely I will come up in the next video. So to get my next video as a notification, subscribe the channel and then tap the bell icon and watch this video until the end to get the complete details regarding this any graduate opportunity notification from the government sector. And now while coming to the present content of the video, it is a NABARD that is National Bank for Agriculture and Rural Development. So from this one here we got the any graduate or the any postgraduate recruitment notification guys. So once after entering into its official website, then here the carrots or notices is there. So just click on this one and then it will be directed to this uh, web page okay, that you may check down here. Okay, and then click here to continue and then it will be directed to this web page guys. It will be directed to this one. So career notices, uh, just scroll down and you may check down here the recruitment to the post of assistant manager grade A, PNSS and grade A, RDBS, Raj Basha service. So you go to the second advertisement that is uh, recruitment to the post of assistant manager in grade A, RDBS. So click on this advertisement and then it will be directed to this one guys. So it is a total 29 pages are there. So we'll check the I mean uh, main important points. And so applications are invited from Indian citizens for the post of assistant manager in grade A in the rural development banking service or Raj Basha service and national bank for agriculture and rural development. So candidates can apply online on about website itself between the 18th July 2022 to 7th August 2022. Okay. So before applying the candidates has to check the complete eligibility criteria and each and everything that I am going to show you very clearly in this video. Okay. So online application starting and closing date is as we already saw that 18th July to 7th August and the phase one preliminary online examination is on 7th September 2022 10 day duly. Okay. So it is online examination based you will get guys and while coming to the main examination we will announce to separately in the official website. So to get qualify for the main examination, first of all, you have to clear the prelims examination. Okay. And so you may check down here, uh, general, I mean, general vacancies under the RDBS and agricultural engineering, fisheries, forestry, land development or soil science, plantation or horticulture, civil engineering, environmental engineering or science, finance, computer or information technology, agri marketing or agri business management and development management. Okay. So total 161 vacancies are there guys. Okay. And coming to the assistant manager in Raj Basha, in here the seven more vacancies are there so that you may check down. And coming to the whatever the different designations I shown you right now, for all these designations, what are the qualifications are required for this position? So that one also we will check step by step here very clearly. Yeah, starting from the assistant manager in grade A, rural development banking service, the academic qualification, general bachelor's degree in any discipline from a recognized university with a minimum of 60 percentage of marks and while coming to the SC, ST, PWD, 55 percentage of marks is required. All of you got it? That means bachelor's degree in any discipline or else a PG in any discipline also fine or okay, postgraduate degree or MBA or PGDM with minimum of 55 marks and 50 marks for these candidates in aggregate or CA or CS or ICWA or PhD from the institutions recognized by the GYI or the I mean government of India or the UGC. That means any graduates can apply, any post graduates can apply and any PhD candidates also can apply for these positions. Okay. So if you check the first point, first point means from here to here, lot of you candidates may confuse here. Okay. If you check from here to here, any bachelor's degree or any post graduate candidates can apply for this position. And if you check from here to here, any PhD candidates okay, can apply for these positions. All of you got it? Fine. No need of experience here. Even though if you are a fresher also no problem, you can apply for this position. Coming to the agricultural engineering, bachelor's degree in agriculture engineering with 60 percentage is required or else the postgraduate degree in agriculture engineering with 50 percentage is required. Coming to the fisheries, bachelor's degree in fishery science or else the postgraduate degree in the fishery science. 
and coming to the forestry bachelor's degree in forestry or also post graduate degree in the forestry land development and the soil science bachelor's degree in agriculture with 60 percentage or also post graduate degree in the agriculture or the soil science or the agronomy and coming to the plantation bachelor's degree or also post graduate uh, degree in the horticulture and civil engineering bachelor's or the post graduate degree in the civil engineering and coming to the environmental engineering so today morning i got one i mean not only today morning yesterday also i got the six comments today morning two comments the candidates are asking for the environmental uh, engineering uh, vacancies guys so this uh, notification will be really helpful to you bachelor's degree or the postgraduate degree in the environmental science or environmental engineering coming to the finance bba or bms with 60 percentage is required or else the bachelor's of financial and investment analysis or else the bachelor's degree in any discipline from a recognized university with a membership of institute of cost accountants of india next coming to the computer or information technology bachelor's degree in computer science or technology or computer application or information technology or else a postgraduate degree in the relevant discipline coming to the agriculture marketing or the agri business management bachelor's degree or the postgraduate uh, degree in the agriculture marketing or agriculture business uh, management and coming to the development management bachelor's degree in the social work so social work related comments also i got from yesterday onward so this uh, notification will be helpful to the social work candidates also development management and development studies with 60 percentage of marks or as the postgraduate degree in the social work here UGC net and all these things not at all required guys if you're having the graduation or the post graduation then you can easily apply for this position okay and coming to the assistant manager in grade year raj basha bachelor's degree from recognized university in english or hindi with hindi and english as a compulsory or the elective subject and pg diploma in translation or else a master's degree in hindi with minimum 60 percentage of aggregate or else a master's degree in English with minimum 60 percentage of aggregate with Hindi as a main or the elective subject. Fine. So total these are the uh, educational qualifications required for the multiple designations whatever they mentioned guys. Coming to the age limitation the candidate must be in between 21 and 30 years of age as on 1-7-2022. Of course age relaxations are applicable as per the government of Indian norms that is like just like 3 years for the OBC and 5 years for the SCST candidates like that. The preliminary examination uh, uh, test I mean, syllabus is also given here. So how many marks will be there and how much time will be allotted to attempt that exam. All these things are mentioned. And uh, the examination will be in the bilingual guys. Hindi as well as the English. Okay. So it will be in the bilingual. And coming to the mains examination also given here. Paper 1 is general English and paper 2 is ESI and the ARD. Okay. And uh, yeah. So you may check down all these details very carefully and coming to the syllabus is also mentioned guys okay so what are the syllabus for the written examinations so that one also you may check down and uh, yeah and coming to the written examination so where you can write this online examination you can write nearer to your centers okay you may check down andaman and nicobar andhra pradesh so in your individual in your respective states you can choose any one of the nearest center guys and from that one you can attempt this examination and coming to the online phase 2 examination few of the centers are mentioned here if you once qualify for the main i mean prelims then you can go for the uh, this uh, mains guys okay so each and everything syllabus is also mentioned and how to apply for this position is that you have to apply through online only okay there is no other mode of uh, application for this one so how to apply online is that see guys I, as i already told you that if you go to the careers then you will get the assistant manager in grade if you want to apply then just click on this one apply here and then your online application processor will starts got it and what are the different uh, things you need to upload in the online application form so all these things are or else the points are clearly mentioned so once go through all these points very carefully before starting your online application form okay and uh, coming to the few general instructions are given here so you can go through this general instructions and identity verification and coming to the salary so how much salary they are going to provide that that point also mentioned here the emoluments and service conditions are mentioned so pay scale selected candidates will draw a starting basic pay of 28150 per month in the scale of so including the grades and each and everything allowances okay just like the dearness allowance local compensatory allowance house rent allowance and grade allowance each and everything totally we are going to get a 70000 rupees per month okay so which will be the very good amount guys as a bachelor's or the post graduates you can easily get this amount and it is a permanent job also so i hope that uh, comparing with the trying in the universities as assistant professor so it is better to try for this type of opportunities 
okay so you are going to get a permanent uh, job as well as the increments also will be there annually as per the 7th cpc uh, annual hikes or the increments so i'm seriously recommending you that okay try to apply for these positions and please share this video to your friends or colleagues who are looking for this type of opportunity it will be very much helpful to them so any graduates or the any post graduates can apply for the assistant manager right so i'm seriously requesting and suggesting you to apply for these positions and prepare very seriously guys definitely will crack the exam and you will get the job also so all the best to the applicants who wants to apply for these positions and to get the more job notifications like this subscribe the channel and then tap the bell icon and thank you very much for watching this video in my youtube channel so once again thank you very very much guys